hey leo welcome back guys so let's go ahead and get you a general reading let's see what is coming towards you guys within the next seven days let's see what's coming towards you and what do you need to be prepared for universe archangels spirit angel guides and guardians guys please keep in mind that these are general readings so they may or may not resonate with you please take what does and leave the rest behind time is fluid so whenever you find this reading you are meant to hear it and there is no gender and tarot guys reverse the roles as need be all right let's see what's going on with my leos universe archangels spirit angel guides and guardians leo stop being so damn stubborn i can't shuffle my cards and mind you i got this smaller deck because of my hand and i'm still having difficulty shuffling your cards what is this overall energy with my Leo universe? What's going on with them? What's coming towards them these next seven days? What can they prepare for? Oh, Leo, get yourself organized, my love. What's going on here? You got the truth, okay? So something is being revealed to you, Leo, these, within these next seven days. And it's the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Beauty. Wow. So I just literally, I mean, I've worked with these cards before, guys, but I've never realized how how these two women are, right, standing before a mirror. So maybe you're telling yourself a truth. You're you're revealing a truth to yourself. You're telling yourself that you're worth it. You're beautiful. You got a good heart. You got a good uh, energy. You got a good aura. It's like you finally seen the truth of something. <laughs> Leo, you're reconciling, my love. You're reconciling. Your career is in a beautiful place. I feel like your finances are starting to get uh, better. If you were struggling, your career, there's clarity in the situation. Your dreams, your dreams have become very, very vivid. Look, it, as I said that, look, Leo, whatever is happening with you, my love, you are destined. This is forward movement. This is, this is your third eye. This is you finally seeing things clearly for what they are. And, you know, the mirror is an energy of you seeing beyond, you seeing the truth to the truth within you. It's like you, you know, have you ever stood in front of a, a mirror and you've been in this energy? I've done it. I've done it many times in my life where I've found myself in a very dark place and I look at myself in the mirror and sometimes I even, I tend to tell myself negative stuff, but what you're going to tell yourself and what I've done in the past is I changed all that negativity and I started speaking empowered words to myself. And that's you, what you're doing to yourself. You're being empowered here. You're you're giving yourself that motivation. It's like you're finally seeing things for what they really are. Your third eye is no longer covered. If you, I feel like you had a, a bandana or a hat bandana or something or tape, whatever you want to consider that was covering that third eye, not no more because something was made very clear to you in the dream state, okay? There is a total transformation happening here for you, okay? There's fertility, there's rebirth, there's new opportunities, there's you reviving a connection, you reviving your finances, you reviving a situation here. Finally, justice, justice in a situation for you, Leo. There's new beginnings, my love, and there's manifestations happening here, okay? So, Leo... If you have been in a very, very dark place and things for you have not been where you want them to be, I am here to tell you, I guarantee you, things in your life are changing, okay? Because there is peace, there is harmony, there is balance. You must have the confidence to forgive, to forget, to let go, forgiveness, there you go, because what is coming towards you, look at whatever it is that's been holding you back, Leo. If you've been angry at your family, if you've been angry at your spouse or your lover or whomever or whatever, your kid, your cat, your dog, does not matter. It's time to let it go. It's time to forgive, okay? And you got to move forward with confidence. You got to move forward with confidence and understand and trust that everything that you're about to get ready to do in your life is divinely guided for you. On the other side of that door, my love, is happiness. It's victory and it's success. It's you closing that door. You closing that door and you walking away from it. Strength, your energy, okay? Your energy. You going, you rising like the phoenix. You're, you're, you, you've been in some real dark negative places, Leo, and things for you are about to completely, completely change. Your career, your finances, even your health. Your mental, your physical, your psychic abilities, your reconciliation, your happiness, your family, okay? It's blessings upon blessings, my love. I don't even want to stop pulling cards for you. Look it. I called you my love, and look what came in. It's financial health. It's freedom. Wow. Leo, understand what I'm about to tell you. What's being presented to you, it's only divinely guided for you. Okay, these blessings are meant for you. Leo, I feel like you have been dragged up and down the block. 
by your little hairs on your chinny chin chin. Okay? But you are being rescued. You are overcoming everything that has happened to you. My love, it's not happening to you. It's happening for you. You've learned some lessons. You've overcome some addictions. You've overcome some very dark ass energies. For some of you guys, you've been cheated on. Your heart's been broken. People have stolen from you. You have been put in places that, man, it takes it takes a true strong person to overcome it. And you did. You actually did. Because what's coming towards you... Is blessings upon blessings. So let me tell you something. Those people that tried to destroy you, those people that tried to break you, those people that tried to to get rid of you, is what I heard. Okay. Um, what's what's going on here is that what's going what goes around comes around. You're about to be blessed. The same people that talk crap about you behind your back are the same people that are gonna be in awe when they see you rise up, when they see you move towards your blessings, when they see you victorious and successful financially stable in a beautiful healthy relationship with the person that you are meant to be with even though for some of you guys you might have walked away from a situation because you felt like you were not good enough or you were not worthy enough to move forward with that person my love things are being made very clear for you you are meant to be with that person okay you are meant to be with whomever it is that you want to be what is the overall energies here for leo universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians serendipity as I was saying, things for you are about to fall into place. In this Pisces season, you're going to see many, many blessings be presented to you. We're getting ready to move into the new moon. And this next new moon is going to be in Pisces. So for whatever apparent reason, I mentioned Pisces season. Things are about to change here. Things are changing for you, my love. It's blessings upon blessings for you. Universe, archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians. What is it? Your yin and orphans. Man, I do feel that for some of you guys, like I said, you were in a very, very dark place. I'm not going to lie to you. A very dark place. You felt abandoned. You felt like the people that you loved walk away from you. There was maybe some death in your family. Whatever it was, I don't even want to talk about it anymore. I'm here to tell you that things are balancing off for you. There is serendipity. There is peace. There is harmony. There is balance. You're about to share your life with somebody who understands you. Somebody that knows where you're coming from. Exchanging gifts. Someone that's going to love you as much as you love them. Someone that's going to look at you as a gift, as a wish fulfillment. There is a lot of love for you here. By the book, okay? I feel like for some of you guys, this is a family that's being formed here. It is three elephants. Three elephants. I don't know how much you guys are into the elephant thing, but I've heard growing up, if you have three elephants in your house, it's always good luck i feel that for you it's finally your luck is changing you've done everything by the book yeah sometimes we're not picture perfect believe me i don't do everything by the book but i just feel that this time around you did something by the book that your blessings are coming in here yang wow this is freaking crazy i said your yang to your yang and look at what came out your yang that's it. Leo, what I have to tell you here is after all these dark energies, after all these negative places that you've been in mentally, physically, and emotionally, you're being blessed. You're being blessed. You're going to be in the world's most loving relationship. Can I tell you, the person that you're about to unite with, the person that you're going to be with, the career that you're in, the finances that are being presented to you, the peace, the harmony, and balance, whatever it is that's being given to you. It is going to bring such a satisfaction, satisfactory energy for you. It's it's amazingly crazy. I just have like this beautiful, overwhelming energy. I just felt like this heat come over me. Leo, you deserve this. You deserve this. Things are being made clear for you. Look, you got the king of stars energy pentacle. So this, you are getting some financial balance here. The hangman. Things are being made clear for you. So whatever you've been going through, Leo... It's a done deal, my love. It's a done deal. Blessings are coming in. Blessings are coming in as of the moment you hear this reading. What is this overall energy for Leo here? Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Leo, if you walked away from a situation, you're going to reconcile with that person because you felt at one point that you walked away from the wrong one. You're about to have a second chance with that person. The Page of Moon here, which is the Page of Cups energy. So there's a message that's coming in, a very loving message. You might be sending the message or they might be sending the message. But look at the Seven of Cups energy here. There's going to be some options that you and this person are going to be able to work on. Okay, Things, were, things have already already changed i feel that you and this person are going to change together there was a lot of heartache okay you had to walk away from a situation there could have very well been a lot of confusion here you caused a lot of heartache they caused you a lot of heartache but with the eight of wands energy here we're going to talk about this and put it to rest 
Okay, we're going to talk about whatever happened in the past and we're going to leave it in the past. It's bringing resolution to a situation here with the Ace of Star, Ace of Pentacles, a stable new beginning here. Look, guys, go back and hear this reading from the beginning. I mentioned to you the next new moon is in Pisces. This is the next new moon here. Okay, come your next new moon, you're going to be in this beautiful, committed relationship. There is forward movement. There is victory and success. You and this person are finally going towards a beautiful, abundant energy. I was about to say Pisces, Leo, but if you are dealing with a water sign, you and this water sign are reconciling. Okay. Or there just might be a lot of love between you and this person. But Leo, let me tell you something. You've had a lot of dark moments in your life. You've gone through a lot of heavy energy. But the truth of the matter, my love, as things are being balanced out for you, the chariot, you are moving towards victory and success. Okay? Things are changing. You have grown from this experience. You're moving towards something beautiful. Night of stars energy. Night of pentacle. I think it took you a while here for you to figure things out. But the truth of the matter, I'm seeing the yin and the yang again. The black and the white here. It's a balancing energy here. It's your moving into your wish fulfillment. You're looking at victory and success. Major, major changes coming towards you within these next six to seven days, I clearly heard. But this is going to be happiness. It's going to be wish fulfillment. It's going to be victory. It's going to be success. Major abundant energies. And like I said, we're ending the reading with what we be with what we began with, which is a reunion and a reconciliation. Because this six of moon is the six of cups. Your past is coming back. But your past is never walking away from you again. Okay? All right, guys. I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you're interested in a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.